handful of the suspected patriotic front cadres that killed one and injured seven of the anti-winter Kabimba team have been arrested by the Zambia Police Service. The Machati waving cadres who had the courage of blocking the busy greatest road and launched scattering attacks on their rivals are under probe for murder and riotous behavior. Home Affairs Minister Edgar Lungu has disclosed that so far 19 out of the more than 100 cadres have been picked for interrogation purposes. Mr. Lungu assures that the law will have to face those involved in the fracas regardless of their political affiliation. And I think the best we can do is sit down and find a way of flashing out such kind of culprits. But for the police, I'm sure they will not be constrained by the fact that it's PF in dealing with this matter. They'll get the root of it. Whoever is found wanting will be brought to book and lessons will be learned so that in future the police will know how to handle uh, processions by people, even those who are in the ruling party. And Vice President Dr. Guy Scott was slapped with questions regarding the Thursday, November 8, 2013, fracas. Now that this is the very first time in the history of this country that there is intra-party violence, violence within the same party, which happens to be the ruling party and has resulted into a death of one of the very unfortunate people that have been sponsored by one or the other warring group within the PM. I want to know from him why the police have charged those 19 with simply a misdemeanor. What is the government doing to ensure that the Janjaweed militia in Zambia are disarmed? We saw all sorts of weapons being used when they were hacking each other and lives were lost. The police were very active yesterday. They are very active this morning in the central business district and other sensitive areas. The uh, charges have already been brought, the docket has already been opened on the murder of somebody yesterday. The police are the right people to maintain law and order. Of course the party needs to give leadership, but you can't always get it right to give leadership to people who are frustrated and, and who are seeking to, to make some sort of benefits out of the situation. Seven of those that were ruthless attacked and nursing serious injuries at Levi Mwanawasa General Hospital as well as the University Teaching Hospital UTH. The Thursday commotion calls for serious measures by the ruling patriotic front in bringing to an end the long-standing confusion surrounding the position of party secretary general Winter Kabimba. Mwape Kumwenda, Movie TV News, Lusaka.